Sassuolo in advance to quarterly talks with foreign club amid Arsenal League say CEO Carnevali and that is the CEO of South Sassuolo. <laughs> Welcome to you. Football news, top tens and live style zone. Please subscribe to this channel so as not to miss out on stories that we do upload in here on a daily. Now, the midfielder is being monitored by Arsenal and Juventus, but the chief executive insists they do not need to sell. That is the chief executive officer of a team which goes by the name of Sassuolo there in Italy. Now, Giovanni Carnevali, who is the CEO of Sao Saulo of Sassuolo, says the club are in advanced negotiations with the club over a potential deal of Manuel Locotelli. The midfielder is rumored to be a target for Arsenal and Juventus following his starring role for Sassuolo in Serie A and Italy at the Euro 2020. Yes, we've all witnessed we've all witnessed him really a man who goes by names of Locatoli coming out and really blessing blessing Italy to that level in there. Though ever since Verratti came in and we got back into the starting positions in there. I think in their third game they played into the group stages up to now. Verratti has been really starting in and and <coughs> And Verratti and, and Locatelli has been really coming off the bench in there, but that does not really side him from the good players that we have. Canevelli says his side will wait until Locatelli returns from the European Championship before discussing his future, but they have already received offers for him. And he really told Sky Italy, that is a man who goes by names of Canavelli, the CEO of Sassuolo. No. What has been said? What has been said is that we have received offers for Locatelli, but also Domenico Berardi, Giacomo Resparodi, and Jamie Boga have requests. The chief executive officer told Sky Sports. We will talk about Locatelli when the Euros 2020 ends. We want to leave him calm until Sunday. We have received important offers for him, talks with one of which are very, very well underway. We met with Juventus and we made an appointment and we made an appointment next week, but it is all to be evaluated. Today the Italian market has great difficulties. Offers come from abroad and it is clear that we have players who are hungry to play for big clubs. That's what the CEO came out and said. Sassuolo in need in no need to sell. Now it looks like Sassuolo is in no need to sell. Now, Sassuolo have already sold Brazilian defender Malum to Shakhtar Donetsk this summer, while Federico Di Francesco went to Spa and Hellas Verona brought Giancimo Mangini. Cav Ca Cavelli says the Italian side have raised money have raised enough money to hold on to their key players for the 2021-2022 campaign. It is a source of pride and tranquility because it means that as a club, we have the opportunity to think about the future that can give us guarantees from the point of view, from an economic point of view in there. Our policy is to try to sell many players. We have already sold Maloney. We do not need to have more to sell or sell another one out of the club. If the right conditions are there, we will all be happy and content and, and contented. If we do not, if we do not find when, we will go on like this because we don't need to sell players. That is what a man who goes by the names of Cavanelli, the CEO of Sao Saulo, has come out and said about a player who goes by the names of Locatelli. Remember, Locatelli is being scouted by Arsenal and they want him to be playing into that midfield pivot with a player who goes by the name of Thomas Pate in there. So Arsenal looks like they're really ready to go on and finance this deal and they really will to trigger his buyout clause because when I reached when I read out Locatelli's buyout clause it's something that can that Arsenal can really can really afford in there because it's not it's not it's not it's not something that is hard for them to really come out and and really pay out for a lad who goes by names of Locatelli in there because he's reported that he's at 40 million euros in there. So I think those are like 35 million pounds in there. I think Asimo can raise such money for a lad that has developed in there for a team which goes by the names of Sapsuro in there from Italy and he might join a team which goes by names of Arsenal because Juventus have not made an official bid in there for the lad but a player 
but the team which goes by names of Arsenal, it is confirmed they really went all out. The man who goes by names of Manuel Locatelli, an Italian professional footballer who plays as a midfielder for Serie A club Sao Paulo in there and the Italy national team. He was born on January 8th, 1998. He's age 23 years in there. He was born in Lecco, Italy. He has a height of 1.86 meters, weight 75 kilograms in their position. He's a midfielder and he plays as a box to box and he can as well play into the midfield pivot in there. Something that Arsenal are really <laughs> dying to have because a player who goes by the names of Grant Jagger, he's on his way out of Arsenal to a team which goes by the names of OS Roma. And rumors really came out last 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 week that liverpool and man city are really looking for his services in there that according to what he expressed into the euros especially into that game against the team which goes by names of france that they knocked out on penalties and he was really a key man in knocking out france it came out and it was all clear that a team which goes by the names of man city and liverpool are looking for him pep Guardiola and jagen Klopp, respectively are really looking for his services so that's all what we had you can as well go into the comment section and you tell us what you what you think about locatelli being being linked to a team which goes by names of Arsenal in there and the man who goes by the names of Cannavelli, the CEO of Sao Solo, coming out and really confirming the reports that it's true. They really need the services of the lad who goes by names of Locatelli and they are really and they've really got a very big, big offer and welcoming offer from a team that is outside outside Italy in there and that team is said to be Arsenal in there so I'm waiting for your views into the comment section below this is already onto this channel Rokan David please feel free to subscribe to this channel so as not to miss out on stories that we do upload in here on a daily after subscribing hit the notification bell that will enable you get notified each and every time we upload a video on this channel I'm out for now see you later guys this is sports news Top 10s and the Lifestyle Zone.